Well, if you're into a surreal art experience in film, then the new Australian film Reflections in the Dust is maybe where you should go. It's the work of Luke Sullivan, who wrote and directed, and it's a strange mix of drama and documentary set in a surreal existential world. Freckles, played by blind former Paralympian Sarah Hubolt, who suffers from Hallaman Streep syndrome, lives on the swampy edge of a lake with her paranoid clown father, Robin Royce Crure. Hey, come on, get my shoe on. Get my fucking shoe on. <laughs> you deserve to eat like a princess. But there may not be any fish. Of course there's fish. It's a fucking lake. There's plenty of fish. Their confrontations are occasionally violent, occasionally loving, but always obsessive. Is their relationship incestuous? His present to her of what seems to be a wedding dress alludes to that, although that is never actually presented on screen. But there are other figures hovering around in the background. One of them is her father's friend, Aldo Fidato. Another is a bird woman, Sage Godry. Intercut with these black and white images are straight interviews with both Hubolt and Quiré, seemingly playing themselves where they're asked various questions about life, fear that. and love. People have said that they've loved me and then treated me quite badly. So what is love? I mean, I've, it hasn't come my way. So why, why believe in it? I'm, I'm not sure if it's possible for me in this lifetime. The contrast these interviews offer to the drama is actually quite confronting. I'm not sure what Reflections in the Dust is about, other than people floundering around in life seeking love affection. But it's certainly a provocative sophomore film from writer-director Luke Sullivan, who's been praised for the casting of Hubolt, and she is certainly brave and convincing, as is Quiré. This is not a film for everyone, but it is maybe a film for the adventurous. Three and a half stars. Are you hungry? <laughs> <laughs>